Hi. Today I'm doing a public service announcement on eye health and uh, glasses. So when I had my um, annual examination this year, the doctor suggested that I go and have my eyes checked because I'm so old now. And um, I guess it's been, I was in California when uh, I last had them checked, so I'm thinking it may have been maybe five years ago when I had them checked, maybe four. And at that time, they told me, you know, that I didn't have any stigmatism or anything, but I did have the beginning of cataracts. But she said, you've got at least 10 years before you have to think about doing anything about it. So this year I went to um, an, an eye doctor, an optometrist in um, Washington State, where I'm living right now. And um, when he did the examination, he told me, yes, I do have astigmatism in one eye. I can't remember which eye it is. And also um, that I have age-related macular degeneration, which sounded a little scary to me. Um, and he said, you know, that I'd probably had it for some years. Uh, I don't know if I had it when I was in California because I was not made aware of that, if that was the case. And um, so he prescribed, well, it's not actually prescription, or they're over the counter, but they are um, vitamins for your eyes. They contain lutein and some other biotin and some other um, things in them. They're called IREDS, I-R-E-D-S-2, I believe it is. So I tried those. I said, okay, yeah, no, let's, we have to take care of ourselves. So yes, definitely, I'll do that. Well, because I have these... Um, digestive issues and I tend to get IBS if I have uh, anything that doesn't agree with me. So I started taking these tablets and sure enough cramps and all the rest of it and he said, I told him about it, he said okay well there's another brand that you can take that maybe will be, you know, contains the same ingredients but is I guess different, I don't know. So I tried those, yep, same thing. And thank goodness for Amazon because if I had bought those from the doctor's office at $40 a bottle, I would not be able to return them. So I did buy them from Amazon and uh, I returned them. So, um, yeah, so I wasn't able to take those. Now, I just went back for a three-month checkup last Friday, and he was saying, well, prior to that, um, before these uh, pills came about, the doctors would recommend you ate two cups of cooked spinach per week. Um, and that would give you the amount of lutein which is the key ingredient for healthy eyes. So, um, yeah, okay, I'll try that. But cooked spinach is a lot, you know, you have to buy a whole heck of a lot of spinach to get cooked spinach. So anyway, I Googled, as one does, food. Um, so I did Google foods that contain gluten because that's, you know, what's important for your eyesight. And kale and spinach is right up there at the top of the list with 6,478 something or others per cup. And it looks like a Y, but a backward Y, G per cup. And then uh, following in a decreasing uh, order is green peas, summer squash, pumpkin, Brussels sprouts, broccoli, asparagus, romaine lettuce, carrots, pistachios. So, 
Um, I'm going to put this on my blog and I'll include the uh, link to the website where I found this information on the uh, Luton. So, there we are for um, health care for your eyes. Make sure you're eating enough of those things to protect your eyes. Now we move on to glasses. So now I'm wearing glasses permanently. I used to wear just the cheaters, you know, that for reading that you would purchase in either the drugstore or the dollar store. They were very inexpensive. And you can get them in various colors, colored frames, etc. cetera. Um, and I thought, okay, well, if I'm gonna wear glasses, I wanna buy a pair that I like, that to me are fashionable. Um, and I'll just get one pair. It'll do everything. So this pair that I'm wearing right now has the um, correction for the stigmatism. Again, I can't remember which eye it was. And it also has um, the progressives. So when you go from indoor to outdoor in the sun, or even just if it's bright out, the lens changes darker to protect your eyes. And it also has at the very bottom um, the area that you read from. So when I look down, I can read just fine. And it also has, um, now I don't remember what the doctor called it or what they told me when I got my eyeglasses was, um, there is a light, a blue light, that emits from, um, you know, your cell phone, your, the television, your laptop, your iPad, whatever, tablet, whatever you're using. And um, it can, you know, interrupt your sleep at night, and uh, et cetera. So I have that on there too. Now, the problem arose when I was, uh, I spend a fair amount of time every day on my laptop, blog, Instagram, I'm starting a brand new project up here in Washington, which I'll reveal s soon. And I found that when I was reading a book, so when you read a book, you know, you cast your eyes downward. And the part here, it's a, it's a small area at the bottom. Um, you know, works just fine. But when I'm looking at my laptop or my, um, my phone, depending on the way I'm holding it, when you look at your laptop, you're looking more straight forward or if you had a desktop, you would be looking outward as opposed to downward. And it was really frustrating for me because the size of these glasses, they're quite large, therefore the reading portion is, you know, tucked down quite small. So I ended up getting myself a pair of reading glasses also. So that is the story of why I have two pairs of glasses, and this one is on my, um, this little attachment thing, so that um, I don't bring my readers out with me. I only use my reading glasses when I'm on my laptop or my phone. And these I wear all the time. So, take care of your eyes. Eat these foods that contain gluten very important for your eyes and your sight and if you have to get glasses make them fashionable why not they're an accessory these days and depending on where you go you know it's a cost yes you have it it does cost however if your prescription changes you can use the same pair of glasses and just replace 
uh, in the same pair of frames and um, just replace the glass area. So I hope that's been helpful. Have a great day.